Let's talk about body preferences. I've heard a lot of talk like, oh, I don't hate fat people, but I'm not attracted to them and I don't want to date them. It's just my preference. Maybe in an ideal circumstance, in a world that was forever body neutral and did not demonize fat people, that could be a preference, maybe. This has to be one of the most ridiculously stupid things I have ever heard, and I've heard a lot of stupid things over the years. Not wanting to date heavier women is, or not even just heavier women, heavier people in general, is not being fat phobic. It's definitely a preference. It's not that it could be, it is. For example, if a black man only wanted to date for ex Asian women, okay, it's just what I'm gonna go with here. Does that make him racist for not wanting to date other races? No, not at all, it's just a preference and almost anybody will say that. Just because you don't want to date somebody doesn't mean you dislike them as a person. What it seems to me is that this woman has been rejected many times and is now taking a video to try to justify it to herself and other people because she's sad and upset. There are girls out there who only date guys with the red hair, girls out there who only date brunettes. Would you call them harassed? and discriminatory for not dating somebody else with a different hair color? No, obviously not, that's stupid. The only thing I could see this being an issue is if you're saying that you have a certain preference, but you're bashing those people at the same time. Like, say for example, you don't like people with black hair, right? You don't like dating people with black hair, and then you go on to explain why people with black hair are disgusting and nasty. That's different, then you're just being a dick. But if you're just saying how it's your preference, then it's a lot different because you're not being malicious. This woman seems to think that it's purely malicious to have an opinion and have a preference. And she doesn't think that it is a preference because people are taught from a young age to think that fat people are disgusting. I don't think fat people are disgusting. I look at everyone in the same exact way, unless you're like severely overweight. If you're like 600 pounds, your life is in danger and you should probably turn it around. Like, I, I don't care otherwise. If your health is fine and you have a bit of weight on you, that's okay. Like, there's nothing wrong with that at all. I don't think that's a problem. But if people don't want to date you for physical appearance, that's fine. It's been like that ever since the beginning of time. Some people are attracted to certain people, other people aren't. There's nothing you can do about that. And you can't make a TikTok video trying to change that and explain why it's wrong when it isn't. Another thing about weight is that you're not stuck with it for your entire life. You can genuinely change the way that you weigh just by putting in the work whenever you want. Any day of the week, you can start this process. So don't act like it's something that you can't change and something that you just have to live with when there are people out there who have dropped hundreds of pounds and feel so much better about themselves. Why don't you talk trash about those people? Are those people fat phobic because they lost weight and wanted to be healthier? Yes or no? There's only one right answer to this question, by the way. Also, I just wanted to say that if you're a supporter of mine and you deem this video to be triggering, then I am not sorry. I think this is actually a pretty serious topic because I've seen a lot of content on this over the years with just completely awful takes. So I thought I'd cover it. With all that being said, and to quickly rehash, there's absolutely nothing wrong with having a preference. If you like to date thinner women, does that make you fat phobic? Absolutely not. If you like to date heavier women, does that make you skinny phobic? Fit phobic? No, it doesn't. There is no phobic in any of this. It's okay to date who you want to date. Don't feel like you need to date somebody else to make someone else happy because at the end of the day, the relationship is to make you and that other person happy. Nobody else. There's nobody else that you need to satisfy besides you two. You're the most important people in the relationship because you are the only people in a relationship. I hope some of you understand what I'm saying, if not all of you. If you don't, you can say something in the comments. That's chill. I don't mind. Maybe you can argue with me. I don't know. Might be a fun day. So, uh, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. Congrats. You made it to the end of the video. Follow my Twitch. If you wanna. If you enjoy mediocre streams that happen once a year from some weirdo in a mask, then I got you covered. Twitch handles on screen, and there's also gonna be a link at the top of the comment section, pinned, so you won't miss it. Also, here's my Twitter and Discord if you wanna add me. Discord link's gonna be down there also, so if you wanna join up, you can do that.